Pakistan is rich in natural resources, offering immense potential for exploration and development in the sector. The commercial energy needs of the country double every 10 years due to its fast-paced industrial development. The Pakistan Oil, Gas and Energy Exhibition caters to the increasing demand for products and services in the oil, gas and energy sector, with an opportunity for the leading players to exhibit and introduce the latest in technology to the growing energy industry of Pakistan. Organized by leading conference and exhibition organizers, Pegasus Consultancy, Pogi has proven to provide a perfect marketing platform while giving impetus to this industry through direct interaction between professionals and key decision makers in this industry. The third Pakistan Oil, Gas and Energy Exhibition was inaugurated by Federal Minister for Privatization and Investment, Dr. Abdul Hafiz Sheikh. He appreciated the role of the organizers in highlighting the immense investment potential present in Pakistan. I would like to congratulate Asim Siddiqui Saab and his team, his colleagues at Pegasus. I think they are a very dynamic group and they are trying their best to bring uh, attention upon Pakistan and to project the tremendous opportunities that are available here into the international community. That uh, as this fiscal year is ending, we can all as a nation uh, feel a certain degree of pride because the hard work of the last uh, several years is beginning to pay off. And Pakistan has uh, achieved an uh, economic growth rate of 8.35%, which is the first time after 20 years. I believe that the sector that you have targeted is one of the most important because it affects almost all other sectors. And I think uh, that this is an area where we have not been very active in the past. And, it's, and in spite of uh, huge reserves of oil and gas and coal and other energy related assets, we have not been able to leverage them. Already the oil and gas sector, the energy sector, if you look at the last 10, 15 years, is the single most important sector attracting foreign investment. And I think this trend is likely to persist. And just as the overall growth is looking good, so the figures on the foreign investment side, the domestic investment side are looking good. If we have uh, large-scale manufacturing growing in, uh, by, you know, between 18% uh, or 18 to 20%, obviously that means that people are investing in the sectors. So this is the biggest proof and biggest evidence of the growth in investment. Our foreign investment figures also, they have quadrupled in the last six years. Mr. Vladimir Mikhailov, Consul General of the Russian Federation, stated in his address that more and more Russian companies are coming every year to participate in this exhibition and evaluate investment prospects in Pakistan. We can say that we would witness great success in arranging this exhibition and many other exhibitions because Pakistan in general is making good success in economy, in uh, political and social development and Karachi is becoming real hub of Pakistani economy and uh, capital of international exhibitions here. We foreign diplomats serving in Pakistan do our best to assist cooperation between Pakistan and our respective countries. And one of the ways to do it is to assure and to, to promote participation of uh, our companies, companies of our countries, in international exhibitions here in Pakistan, in Karachi in particular. And I'm proud to say that uh, year after year, more and more Russian companies are coming to Karachi 
and in particular to this exhibition to participate because we would like to establish more closer and more mutually beneficial cooperation with Pakistan. Soviet Union some decades ago uh, actively participated in a bringing of oil and gas sector of Pakistan. Mr. Asim Siddiqui, managing director of Pegasus Consultancy, stated that the exhibition has attracted participation of more than 153 companies from 28 countries of the world within a short span of three years. Pegasus Consultancy is the pioneer and the leading event organizer in Pakistan. This exhibition is our sixth exhibition within this year. We take pride in stating that our exhibitions have played a vital role in highlighting the various industries of Pakistan and in helping bring together manufacturers and their related technology providers to benefit the trade and investment in Pakistan. Ladies and gentlemen, we are especially excited about our energy exhibition because this industry in Pakistan has been growing at a much faster pace than the average GDP growth of Pakistan. The requirement for energy and power is doubling every 10 years. The new millennium has brought a new focus on the energy resources of this country. The realization of making a 20-year policy on the identification and acquisition of energy resources by the government of Pakistan has brought with it significant changes to the infrastructure of this industry. Dr. Hafiz surveyed the exhibition that is spread over three halls of the Expo Center and met representatives of domestic and foreign companies. An energy exhibition hosts a two-day conference which is addressed by prominent speakers from local and international organizations and institutions. The subject for the current year was Pakistan's oil, gas and energy industry challenges and opportunities. Minister of State for Petroleum and Natural Resources Mir Mohammad Nasir Mengal and Chairman Board of Investment Vaseem Haki chaired the first session of the conference. Cover the seven, uh, seven to ten years. Oil and gas will be the main energy resource. And the other sources like coal, hydro, and renewable will continue to private sector, local, and foreigners to come forward to participate in Pakistan's economic development. Oil gas investors. And uh, as a matter of policy, uh, we would encourage OGDC to go and see prospects abroad. So they are uh, working on that. Uh, and we would expect that they would enter into some kind of an arrangement very soon with some parties. The POGI conference offers an excellent platform for exchange of views and dissemination of information to the highly targeted audience from the world's energy industry. At the same time, it underlines the growing exploratory efforts as well as prospects for investment in the development projects in Pakistan and its neighboring countries. The third Pakistan Oil, Gas and Energy Conference was attended by a large number of decision makers from mining, refining, supply and distribution companies operating in the region. Speakers from Germany, Malaysia, Libya, India, and the UAE dressed the conference. That, uh, the air is cleaner, and also those uh, respiratory diseases associated with pollution have been minimized to almost a uh, very low level. And in Bangkok too, in Argentina, in Buenos Aires, also they use uh, a lot of uh, 
natural gas to run their public transportation system. And Singapore also we are trying out with the CNG. From Qatar, as we all know, uh, the successive governments of Pakistan has contemplated gas importation since the uh, mid 80s of the last century. Uh, Crescent Petroleum, for gentlemen who are not, uh, uh, it was introduced to you before, is uh, the first Arab private oil and gas company that was formed uh, in the UAE. Our headquarters is in Sharjah and our main operation is in Sharjah. Uh, we've taken the initiative to propose this uh, gas pipeline between Qatar and Pakistan as early as 1990. We were the first company to contemplate a pipeline and to propose such a pipeline from the Gulf to uh, South Asia. But uh, uh, purely as an aside, I would say that uh, water also is a very important uh, element in our economic uh, development and water is indigenous and I think there is a need uh, for a conference like this to be held where discussions can take place on the harnessing uh, of water resources for maximum utilization and value. A uh, number of uh, energy plans have been prepared and all of them are of excellent quality and uh, they may come to uh, somewhat different conclusions in terms of numbers, but uh, the essential fact is that there is going to be an expo exponential growth of demand. And that uh, demand has to be met both by indigenous and imported resources. To manage costs is important in order to uh, have good profits that can be reinvested in further growth in order not to increase prices on the markets, so to keep inflation under control. Going into a higher efficiency, loss reduction, you know, 36, 38% in Karachi Electric, 26% in Wagda, these have to be reduced. From here on, uh, some numbers have been looked at for the next 25 years. All, if this is achieved, would start overtaking uh, the other two sectors oil and gas, it will never replace but will have a higher potential. The show serves as a comprehensive showcase of the latest in technology, equipment and machinery as well as allied services to match the growing needs of the local as well as regional energy industry. The exhibition has been successful in attracting a large number of trade delegations and corporate visitors from the energy sector as well as diplomatic corps representing countries from across the globe. More than 150 exhibitors from 28 companies participated in this exhibition. Foreign and local participants expressed satisfaction on the contacts made with the trade delegations and industry experts. Uh, this exhibition is um, uh, an opportunity for the, the industry to actually um, come and see what's available in the market as form of international um, companies, international um, exposure. Uh, a lot of people don't even know that we have um, a, lot, a lot of these items in stock and it makes them much easier to, 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 to get hold of. It's a very good platform to all the local uh, businessmen, uh, local organizations as well as multinational organizations. And uh, more and more will If it is for the third time, we hope that next year there will be different ventures. Now, like in the inauguration ceremony, the Russian consulate came forward. So I would hope that all the consulates will be able to go for joint ventures with the Pakistani organizations. Our stations were uh, in своего потребителя в Пакистане. And uh, the main goal of our uh, participation in this exhibition is to promote our products to Pakistan market. And we hope for this. Мы в этом году привезли новые разработки, более надёжные, более перспективные электростанции. This year we represent our modernized versions of our power generating sets and we hope that uh, we can find uh, for uh, Pakistani customers.
This is a Russian based company uh, with headquarters in Moscow and um, we actually are distributors of uh, different uh, you know these cables and pipes. Uh, this company is in Pakistan for the first time. Response is very good. People are coming uh, to the store and they're asking concrete questions. Even they're asking uh, how can we uh, make any agreements with you and whether you have any representative office here. And um, we, we can say that response is very good. Yeah. Our company uh, design, manufacturing and supply drilling equipment for Pakistan and uh, Arabian countries. Uh, good experience uh, supply drilling equipment for Pakistan. Uh, two drilling rigs uh, working in OGDC. It's now time we uh, need. Uh, надеется как? Надеется. All the, the response. Uh, new contacts with uh, private drilling uh, companies. Uh, I would like to present uh, Russian companies which are taking part in this uh, exhibition for the second time and uh, I'm very glad to present all these companies on the stands and the stalls and I hope that uh, in the nearest future uh, the uh, Russian participation on uh, this exhibition and not only this exhibition but other exhibition uh, which is held in this country uh, will be rising and uh, our uh, collaboration between uh, Russia and uh, Pakistan will be in increasing with every passing year. Pogi has set records in being the only exhibition in Pakistan to attract the largest ever participation from the Russian Federation in the form of Russian Pavilion comprising eight companies. Other participating countries include Germany, Italy, Singapore, the UAE, the United Kingdom and the United States. Industry players visiting the exhibition showed keen interest in the machineries that Pakistan has to offer. Machineries have also been sold on site that reflect the manufacturing competence that Pakistan possesses in the energy industry. Aiming at establishing new contacts with the most productive business environment, Pogi provides investors with a definite outlook of the regional industry and an opportunity to meet their prospective counterparts and business partners from all over the world. A large number of meetings were held among trade visitors and exhibitors in order to explore profitable opportunities for their future business growth. The third Pakistan oil, gas and energy exhibition concluded with promising results not only for the local exhibitors but also for the participating international companies and visitors as well. Considering the overwhelming response from the industry, the organizers Pegasus Consultancy have scheduled the fourth Pogi show in May of 2006.